Major weather changes about to slam our state. Byron's here to tell us when wind, rain, and even some snow is coming. Yeah, and look at what we have out there right now. It's just gorgeous. I mean, we have the sunshine. We have temperatures in the 70s. Get outside and savor the last few hours we have of this. So we've got a big fall storm for this weekend into next week. The strong winds, the dropping temperatures, the rain, and yes, the high elevation snow. Some of that snow could mix in even at the lower elevations. So wind advisories tomorrow for the Sangre de Cristo Mountains, Angel Fire, Red River, also Las Vegas, and southwest Colorado around Cortez and northeast Arizona and around Apache. We could have those winds gusting 50 to 55 miles per hour. Look at this, a winter storm watch in effect for the San Juan Mountains around Durango, 7 to 14 inches late tomorrow through Sunday. That's just the beginning of this storm system. So this is what it looks like for tomorrow in Albuquerque, starting off chilly in the 40s, but by the afternoon, we're warm again in the 70s, but the breezes will be up at about 15 to 25 miles per hour, some stronger gusts possible, and also we'll have more clouds, a slight chance of a shower. So starting off quiet for all parts of New Mexico, with the exception of the high terrain, I do think that we'll have wind developing across a large part of the state. Still mild temperatures to warm temperatures across New Mexico for your Saturday and a slight chance of a shower. These are the wind gusts tomorrow. Notice where we see the red and orange across the mountains and western part of the state. That's where the winds will be the strongest for your Saturday. On Sunday, more widespread wind for a broader area of New Mexico, especially in the mid part of the day into the afternoon hours. And some of those wind gusts could even cause some damage in spots. And then those showers, rain and high elevation snows across the full corner region spreading into Farmington, Durango, Taos, Santa Fe, and also Gallup and Grants later Sunday. We could have some showers popping into Albuquerque late in the day on Sunday too. And this is Monday morning. Look at that rain and snow showers. We could have a mix of rain and snow even in Albuquerque as we get into Monday morning, creating some difficult travel for some around New Mexico. Farmington, the four corners, big changes, breezes up tomorrow, and then showers picking up with rain and high elevation snow as we get into Sunday, dropping temperatures. And look at that freezing temperatures by Monday morning in Farmington. Southwestern parts of the state, we're looking at those gusty winds tomorrow, picking up even stronger Silver City, TRC, and Elephant Butte on Sunday, and then dropping temperatures with showers on Monday. Into the southeast, we're looking at breezy conditions, Rodoso, and also Roswell, Carlsbad, and then stronger winds Sunday. Look at that fall in temperatures from 81 Sunday to 65 on Monday in Roswell. In the northeast, Raton, Las Vegas, Santa Rosa, and Moriarty, big changes for you. Windy for both tomorrow into Sunday. The strongest wind day would be Sunday. Sunday. And then look at that, a high of 46. I do think that we'll have some accumulating snow around Las Vegas, New Mexico and Raton as we get into Monday morning. Santa Fe, Los Alamos, Taos, Española, the Northern Mountains. Yeah, we're looking at some gusty winds tomorrow. Santa Fe, windier on Sunday with a chance of showers. And Santa Fe could have some snow showers as we get into Sunday night, Monday morning. Here in the metro, tomorrow breezy, highs in the 70s. Bernalillo, Rio Rancho, Los Lunas and Berlin. But look at that change. We get windy with impact weather for Sunday. Gusts could be up to 50 miles per hour and then dropping temperatures. Monday morning, it's going to be cold, but look at this. This by Tuesday morning, Darlene and Doug, we get our freezing temperatures. Look at those upper 20s for the <laughs> valley locations. <laughs> I don't crazy. like that. And we're in the 70s now. It's and like 49 just days <laughs> away. <laughs> yeah, I know. That's I'm, quite the flip, I'm Byron. Sorry. sorry to bring we the bad news. Hold on to this a little <laughs> we'll blame bit you. longer. <laughs> Thank you so much. Welcome. Sure.